Well, here's something on just about everybody's holiday to do list this 4th of July. A big part is cooking out. So we have teamed up with the folks from Famous Dave's. And when I say we, I don't mean the two of us because somebody else got this very difficult. Uh, that somebody else would be our very own Brandon Rue. He is out on the patio this morning with Famous Dave's. They're going to be with us all morning long talking about smokers. Good morning. Hey, good morning, guys. Yes, I finally drew the long straw and get to do the barbecue segments all morning long. Thanks to our great friends at Famous Dave's and Pitmaster Casey Schmidt is here with us. Good morning. Hi, good morning. Good to see you. You're up bright and early, but you've got some great tips. We're not just uh, telling people necessarily about how to flip a burger, but uh, this is a pretty intense switch over from a, a grill to a smoker and you're going to help us convert. Yes, absolutely. So uh, we smoke all of our meats in house and right now it's really popular for people it to is. do this at home. So we're going to show you actually how to take your normal uh, charcoal grill at home and you can actually turn it into a smoker. Wow. Now people, a lot of people are buying smokers. They've got them at home and others maybe a little leery, but you think it's easy enough to do? Yeah, I mean, this is just your, your uh, try it out, see if you like it. Okay. Um, and then you can always invest in something more, but this is so simple. How do we start? All right, so you just want to get some small wood chips. You can get this at the grocery store, hardware store, um, and you want to soak them for about 30 minutes. Just it's soak them in water? Yep, just soak them in regular water. Okay. But it's, it's important uh, just to help with the smoldering. All right. And then you'll just double foil. Just fold right on over, fold again, and you're really just making kind of a wood chip packet, if that makes sense. It does. <laughs> and that's going to give a little flavor, I guess, too, depending on yep. what kind of wood? Yep, exactly. So you can pick any kind of wood that you want. Poke a couple holes in it, not too many big holes, but really the idea is that you're going to set this inside directly on these charcoals. Okay. I'm gonna take this off. Wow, so it's hot, Casey. <laughs> <laughs> but you're just gonna set it directly on those charcoals. Okay, charcoals are underneath. Yep, so this way, the wood's gonna get hot enough, it's gonna smolder and it's gonna smoke, but it's not actually catching fire and creating too much heat. You're just using the smoke to create flavor. So how, it's, it's really neat. How long do you want the chips in there to, to smoke things up before you put your, your meats or veggies on? Great question. Really depends on your protein. So uh, something that's thicker, something that's more robust, it's going to take you a longer time. You probably would like that for about an hour. Okay. Uh, but something simpler, I mean, you can smoke hamburgers. You probably only need 30 minutes. How about that?